Hey beautiful and kind people, welcome back to my channel, Anyang. So the reason why I did that is because uh, today's uh, video is again going to be a special one for you guys and um, I was excited to uh, do this because I love, uh, okay so I'm going to say what I'm, what this video is going to be about. It's going to be about my favorite Korean drama. Uh, and a drama that is must watch. The reason why I wanted to uh, shoot this video was because I really really want uh, many people to watch this drama. I mean even if uh, you're not a, a, you know a drama fan or uh, you don't really watch uh, Korean stuff I really want you as well to go ahead and um, take a look at this uh, drama so without further ado I guess let's begin before I start I will put it how put it out here somewhere my uh, my Instagram uh, ID uh, it will be here somewhere so go follow me on my Instagram because I keep um, you know I keep posting a lot on my Instagram in regards with what my next video is going to be about and you know just a lot of stuff so do go ahead and follow me there uh, and yes let's go ahead so um, I uh, and yes I forgot to say that it's a Netflix original it's okay to not be okay uh, and I don't remember how I again came about uh, with these series um, and I don't think somebody recommended it or something I just uh, Again, it popped up in front of my uh, uh, Netflix series screen. Like I was just like scrolling, and I was like, I want to watch something. And I saw this, and I was like, I was really, uh, um, what do you say? It caught my eye. You know, I was, I was like, this is something interesting. You know, and um, I, uh, I knew the actor, uh, Kim So Hyun. Uh, I hope I am pronouncing the names right. If not, please don't come at me. Uh, uh, so yeah, I had watched few uh, dramas of this actor Kim So Hyun, uh, who is also in another drama called uh, My Love from the Star. Um, this specific video is going to be only dedicated to It's Okay to Not Be Okay. I was going to make. Uh, I was going to review one more K-drama but then I thought that you know it would have distracted uh, this uh, drama and I wanted to focus only on uh, this drama it's okay to not be okay because uh, because of the fact that how different this drama is from the other dramas and how how impactful and how um, you know how how much message this drama holds and there's a lot there's a lot i want to say so yes uh, i knew this actor from that drama and uh, uh, and the um, the actress is uh, seo ju hyu i think i i'll have to just check because so that i don't spell anything wrong yeah kim so hyun and uh, seo seo ji and um, it is written by jo yong and directed by Park Shin Woo. Uh, so yeah, written by Jo Yung. This uh, drama, this uh, I mean the story is written by Jo Yung and directed by uh, Park Shin Woo. I'll try to put it, put them up here so that you get to know. And yeah, acted out by Kim So Hyun, the most handsome freaking guy. Like everybody loves him. He's on. He's, an, he's not just a good looking guy, he's also an amazing actor and uh, I love Seo uh, Yeji, like I love her uh, personality and uh, stuff like that. So yes, coming back to the drama, so I got curious, I wanted to watch it and um, I, I started and I just, I couldn't stop watching after that. Like let me be honest you guys the thing with me is that i'm very selective and i have a very um you know like fine or you know i'm very picky when it comes to watching series watching dramas and you know like 
this this drama or this series has to really be something for for it to you know like keep me seated and to watch so this drama did a really good job with that because once i started watching i couldn't stop and i was like one after the other i finished it off like that and i remember um, i remember watching it sorry for that uh, i remember watching it and um, i just felt this emotion i just couldn't stop thinking about how amazing this drama is and you know uh, how they have pieced it together um okay so let's begin i'll start off with uh, what the main theme is um you know the characters uh, the setting as we always do you know like talking about this uh so the the whole concept of this uh, drama it's okay to not be okay revolves around uh, mental health and uh, you know how important it is to take care of our mental health and they have shown how uh, you know how trauma can actually affect a person and the people around that person and the whole so the whole uh, concept of drama is around mental health and around that uh, mind related stuff um and if we talk about the characters i loved how uh, you know i don't i don't really know if you know like who really casted who did the casting but amazing job because uh, again what i love about korean dramas is that they have this huge casting you know they have a big family normally uh and i love i love how they always have a uh, second you know like a uh, heroine or like you know second uh second heroine and um uh you know like second um uh, uh actor actress whatever i love how uh, they have a huge cast and they don't uh, you know they always k drama korean uh, dramas always have that feel of uh, like a movie you know like every time you watch a series you feel like you know you're watching a movie because that is how huge their productions are that is how much they invest in their series it is not just for the fact ki okay you know we want to make this series and we just want to be do it on a low budget no they really spend a lot they go on the detailing part and that is what i love even with the characters in uh, it's okay to not be okay they have actually given a detailed character to you uh, when it comes to uh, kim so you the main character in the series i just loved how uh, they built that character it is a character who is very like down to earth and has a character of you know helping so he is shown as a helper most of the times and then there he has his brother who is uh, autistic so i don't want to uh, spill out a lot so i won't talk a lot you know in regards with uh, characters and more of that but uh, i'm just i just want to given you know what and why i love this series uh, so yeah i love the characters i loved another thing i loved about this series was that normally if you watch this series you will feel like okay you know it is a serious it is a emotional serious and heavy uh, concept themed uh, drama which it is but on the other hand it is also very uh, funny so there's a lot of humor that has been put in and it actually makes you know this this humor actually brings balance to the drama uh, brings a brings a perfect balance to it because you feel a little light then because i feel like if they wouldn't have put in uh, humor i feel like you know it would have been very heavy for people you know the ones who were watching because there is there are a lot of heavy concepts in the drama when even when, when it comes to because it is mental health right and uh, we all know how sensitive and how fragile this particular concept of this topic is so for that reason uh, i think they did that they have put in a bit of humor and i i really liked how how perfectly balanced it is it is not like over the top you know it is not like it 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 doesn't take away everything you know from the the main uh, concept of the drama so that is another thing that i loved and i li- i liked how those characters e- even the characters you know have uh, bought that humor and you know like they have done it so smoothly so a big wow a big you know like uh, applaud for like for those characters 
ओके ना वी टॉक्ट अबाउट द कंसेप्ट वी टॉक्ट अबाउट कैरेक्टर्स अ लिटिल बेट इवन वेन आई टॉक अबाउट दि एक्ट्रेस लाइक द लाइक सर्जी यू वॉट एवर ओ माई गॉड एम सॉरी सो शी हैज दिस कैरेक्टर that is amazing like it has shown like you know she is uh, super bold and super like you know like it is a very realistic series first of all and they have shown how you know there are some um, humans who pretend like you know that we are strong we are bold nothing can touch us and you know that kind of character but again deep down she has show she has you know she is very soft she is very fragile she has gone through some shit and but then she doesn't want to show that she doesn't want to be like a cry baby or she doesn't want people to see that side of her so that is a kind of character that uh, uh, the the character has in it's okay to not be okay and uh, so she and the male character the main actor they are shown as very different uh, complete opposites and how they come across and they have known each other for a while they've known each other and all that story and it's a very dark theme uh, concept but again as i said humor comes in and it lightens you up uh, so yes about the characters is that another thing i really loved about how they've shown his brother so uh, his brother is uh, you know has autism and that is you know something i i really want people to understand Uh, what autism is and how autistic people are because normally uh, there is there is one more series i would i would really review on uh, it's a english series called atypical uh, most of you might be knowing it uh, but uh, that is another one i will definitely uh, make a video on i will do a review on that for sure um, so yeah i have seen and i have uh, you know like i have uh, understood this that people don't really understand what autism is and what it is you know like you know what actually is going with you know like an autistic person and that you know sometimes people people feel that oh they are weak they are this they are that they don't understand and it is not like that they are very very uh, smart people they understand everything you say it is just that the way they process is not like us they don't process like a normal being their way of understanding and their way of thinking and their way of acting is very different than us but most of the times they are very very possessive they can be very protective they can be very um very giving very loving this is the beauty of this people you know like the the ones that people label as you know abnormal honestly speaking they are the most normal people like i mean i would rather say that they are the best than us normal humans because they are more giving they are more loving they just you know they just want you to be happy that is the whole their whole goal you know for you and i i really loved how this series has brought that uh, perspective or oh, i really loved how they they have showed you know that this is autism and you know like this is not how people really portray as you know and definitely there are some challenges that uh, come with them you know it's not easy to uh, handle them because they have a lot going on in their head and all that stuff so uh, again i don't want to say a lot because i want you guys to watch it and i want you guys to go on that journey with this series uh because it is definitely a hell of a roller roll, uh, hell of a roller coaster um and yeah so that is a part of it uh, his brother has autism and stuff like that so uh that is another part i loved about this series you know um uh, and i really loved how uh, you know like every single episode has a new a different topic and you know they have shown they have shown scenes from hospital and they have shown other patients you know dealing through trauma and i really another part that i really loved guys was that they have actually shown that a person who has been through something you know some kind of trauma how that person actually deals with it and how you know sleepless nights and having that nightmare kind of situation happening and you know anxiety and these are some of the things that they have really really focused on and shown and i 
loved it because I because as I said previously, I am a psychology student. I am pursuing that, and I I mean I could I could really dig into that or I could really dive deep because I know. Uh, to say like of course you know like we all have anxiety i have anxiety we all have been through shit i have been through shit and especially for the ones who actually been through it will really you know understand feel you know what is happening in the series because you can then relate you can then be like oh you know i have been i have been through this or i can feel this i can understand what this person is going through right so that is what i loved how the series you know connects with you especially if you're a person who actually has been through that uh, you know it's very relatable kind of situation happening so yes so i really loved that as well that they shown the experience you know that this is what a person actually goes through when that person has been through trauma etc etc so that is another part one more part that i love that i love about korean dramas is the music you know it is always so touching it is always so you know it it like every like i'm not just talking about it's okay to not be okay i'm talking about every other k drama that i've watched the music part is so amazing again being a musician myself i i am just like i'm always like what i'm always like wow like the music and the production and the you know even the lyrics like honestly speaking there are some korean uh, you know like in k drama the songs and all i have gone uh, aside and i've i've looked at the lyrics and i'm like this is beautiful like they just don't invest in the characters or they just don't invest in the series or whatever but they also invest a lot in music because music is everything you know the feel the vibe that you get you know while you're watching that emotion or that particular action happening it actually gives you a feel through music so again i love the music as well in this drama it is very uh you know they they also have their music on spotify and also if you later on also want to go and hear it out you can i have added them in my playlist um i also try adding that Uh, uh in the description so that it will be, it will become easier for you guys to just go ahead and listen to it so i'll do that for you guys only for you guys <laughs> so yeah coming back to the topic uh so that is another thing that i liked how you know they also focus on music and just you know bringing the whole feel and the vibe to the person who's watching so i think i've uh, uh I've said everything in this video, like because I don't want to again say a lot, again you know spill spill uh, a lot of stuff because then you know the whole excitement just goes away of the drama. I want you guys to go watch it, really, 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 please, please, please watch it. I tell this to everyone, all my friends, anybody I meet, I'm like, have you watched It's Okay to Not Be Okay? You have to watch this K drama because. I mean of course there are other K dramas that are amazing I will do a review on those as well because there are many other K dramas that are you know definitely must watch you know they are worth watching it but this one in particular you know is still on my number 1 you know uh, you know on the list it's number 1 because it it has this something you know that storyline that um, that's something that can't be expressed you know it is definitely very different than every other k drama that i've watched i have not watched any series yet in hollywood as well that is comparable with this i'm literally going to that point you guys so that is the reason i'm pleading you to watch this drama it is definitely going to be something that you're going to you know you're going to get attached to and it's going to be a part of you for sure like it has been a part of me and so please go ahead and watch it it's on netflix i don't know if it's there on any other platforms i will definitely check that if there if there is and i will put it in description if i find uh, it on some other platform but it is there on netflix so go ahead watch it let me know in the comments section you know after you watch what you felt and how did this uh, you know drama affect you and you know emotionally you know anyway any any how it affected you let me know i would really love to know you can let me know in the comment section or you can let me know through dms you can text me on my socials you know anything anything works 
so yes so go watch it and please recommend this uh, drama to your friends to your family it is it is something that everybody can watch you know there is there are no there's not much of adult content you know that you have to be like oh how will i you know watch how will i tell my parents to watch it or like my little brother sister no anybody can watch it it is made for uh, you know family entertainment purpose kind of so uh, so yes so go ahead share it with your friends family you yourself go watch it if you haven't and to the person who is watching and who isn't into uh, korean dramas and all please go ahead and watch it and definitely watch other k dramas because your whole perspective will change and you know just don't listen to others and be like ah, what korean no it is actually very good and the concept the stories that they bring in are very different than you might see in hollywood series very different concept they i also want to make a review on italian series italian movies uh, there are french french series french movies and i really want to make video video on these because i want people to watch them as well like the 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 way they make series the way they make movies are very different than what you see in hollywood you know the style the storyline is completely different i love watching french italian movie series for that reason you know it is different it is new it's fresh and i want you guys to do the same that is the reason why i will be coming back with more videos as such you know like uh, touching different topics and uh, you know talking about giving review on different uh, series and movies that i have watched and uh, yeah you can also uh, recommend down in the comments section what you have watched and you want me to watch you know do recommend it down i will definitely go through your, go through the comments and i will try to uh, you know watch the ones that you recommend so that's it guys for today's video i hope i hope i hope uh you liked it and if there are some things that i've missed in my video please let me know in the comments below uh i will try to cover it up uh in my next video if possible um and yeah that's about it uh don't forget again to like share and subscribe if you haven't because that is how you support me and that is how i will be able to make more videos like these for you guys and uh, hit the notification bell somewhere here somewhere hit the notification bell because uh, that is how you will stay updated because i as i said as i keep saying i keep uploading random videos every every single wednesday every wednesday so just so you don't miss my videos do hit the notification bell because if each of my video is going to be interesting informative and there's a lot coming ahead so i personally don't want you guys missing it so do hit the notification bell do subscribe and yeah i will see you guys in my next video till then bye bye take care